I am supposed to be doing uh, a review on the Feel World 7 inch monitor and I want to get some unique shots uh, of the of the monitor itself so I am going to be using the Pico Dolly and I do have the Sony a7 III with the 24 mil G Master lens on it so that's what I'm going to use to capture some unique shots on the table itself I do have the 7 inch monitor set up right in the middle of the table itself and I do have the dolly set up and I also have the wheels set up to the point where it's going to be circulating around the 7 inch monitor. Right now I had to make sure that it would actually cut right here so it doesn't fall off because what I'm going to have to do is be on that side and flick the dolly so it goes all the way around and comes right back and stops right here. That's where I'm going to cut it. It took me several times for me to just let go because I did flick the dolly itself and I was I actually caught it because I was scared. Make sure when you use it, don't put the camera up all the way to the front because it's going to be front heavy and the whole pika dolly itself is going to come up forward. So you have to set it up to the point where it's in the center of the gravity so it's balanced out well and there's no shake when you're sliding the uh, pika dolly itself. So basically I was trying to, I tried it twice with holding the camera itself and doing it and I felt like there was going to be a shake on there. Uh, so I did one with me holding the camera itself and doing it and then one with the Pico Dolly itself. But this scene right here was basically I was trying to get the shot where I would have this in between the plants that I have here and I was going to use those as props. Unfortunately, I didn't like the plant thing so I, what I thought was why not advertise the box itself. So I switched that out. So in this last shot, I was actually uh, did it on uh, autofocus rather than manual focus because there was really nothing else in the frame itself. So yeah, depends guys. Pick and choose on uh, particular shots you're going to take and what kind of settings you're going to have. That's pretty much it guys those are some of the things that you can actually do with the pico dolly itself and i wanted to get these shots for my review that i'm going to be doing on the field world monitors well you guys know what to do already if you guys like these kinds of videos that i'm doing click the subscribe button if you enjoyed watching this video uh click the like button and comment let me know what you guys think and uh peace